All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Grounded Part 32. I have been sick for a solid week. I'm actually recording this only a couple of days before it'll be out on YouTube. Usually I like to be about a week ahead of time, but I've been sick and not been able to record. So I've done a little stuff in Grounded since last time. Nothing that you guys would really want to see. I ran back from the black, black Ant Lab, obviously, and then I've just been building. Because it's something I can do by myself without having to record. Because while I was sick, I was coughing a lot and my voice sounded awful. It wasn't even worth recording. But I wanted to show y'all what kind of progress we've made building-wise. Um, <laughs> and then go ahead and do the episode, which will be day... 50 in game day 50 i've been working for a few in game days this is the end of day 49 right here that we're doing right now uh no water left on the dew collector right now so we're gonna go ahead and bring all our stuff back and there is a scaffolding thing happening back here that i've been working on go and grab our sap a little bit here again uh we have had the mushrooms grow a couple of times it's definitely nice it helps the health it helps the hunger a little bit, but it's definitely not enough to feed us on its own. We'll probably need more farms if we're going to be self-sufficient here. But let's go ahead and go ahead. Alright, so you see the scaffolding here? I made a staircase, and this goes up to this floor. Which then goes up to this floor. Which then goes up to this floor. Which then goes up to this floor. And we're going. And we're going. And we're going. And going. And going. And we're still going. Look how much progress I made. And so I got us high enough here. Um, uh, I thought about going all the way to the top of the tree. But these treks are becoming so long. I figured we were high enough. Look at our view back here now. Look how high above we are to everything. We could just... We could make a zip line down over to that. And I actually do want to start building this way. Um, and the ladders are almost constructed this high. Honestly, the main problem is that we don't have enough acorn tops. I've been trying to harvest acorns non-stop. Uh, we might be able to zip line to the porch from here. I'm not sure. Um, the sandbox. Uh, picnic table, probably. Up to here to the shed area. There should be no area, at least nowhere, like except for maybe like a, a back corner of the garbage bags or something like that, that we shouldn't be able to reach. If we make a like a quick ring around the tree here at this height, I feel like this is high enough to be able to hit anything. Uh, let me grab my weed stem pallet because I needed that to make ladders with. And yeah, now we just need more acorn tops and then we are set. So let me go back to ladders. I did make a trampoline to see if I could make like a, like a trampoline system here, but uh, I I couldn't figure out a way to make trampolines work, so no dice on that. But I did create a trampoline at some point. And there we go. The final ladder piece. And now the ladder system goes all the way up to the top. <laughs> yeah. We just need acorn tops for the rest of these blue ladder pieces. And then we can get all the way up here. Just straight up. Perfect. And all of it says supporting zero. So all that's going well too. I'm going to leave this scaffolding here. Even after the ladder is done so that we can move grass planks and stem pallets up this high. Um, however, obviously, uh, and this is just faster for getting down. Obviously, um, and sometimes I do that and hurt myself a little bit, but it's okay. Uh, what was I saying? Uh, but obviously, once it's all done being constructed, like it's all completely destructed construct it, I'll take down the scaffolding and we can just use the ladder to get up and down. This bee loves to hang around. He's good, though. Uh, he's, he's in here. I think, I think I leave that alone. I think if I fight him, things are gonna break. <laughs> I think if I fight him, things are gonna break, so let's not. Um, did we already research everything? Did we do that on camera? Oh, wow, yeah. It's been a while since I played, so I don't remember what we've done and what we haven't. Alright, looks like we have researched anything. We just need to turn stuff into Burgle, so... 
Let's go do that. Um, yeah, I'll continue working on this another time. And I'm just, I'm just going to pretend that that bee isn't there. Because that's weird. So let's get down to Burgle. How's our dandelion tuft looking? We don't have one. Then it's a good thing I didn't jump, huh? Imagine that's how we lose hoops. That would be so stupid. That'd be max level stupid. Alright, one for later, one for now. There we go. Let's go ahead. Uh, actually, before we jump down, there's also a little bit of roof. Um, I need to finish up over here. I don't remember. Did you guys see that this roof was constructed last time you saw the base? Um, that might actually be new, too. The roof to the uh, basketball court is finished. So that might be new as well. And there you go. Now it's, now it's actually done. You were there for the end of it if you haven't seen any of that yet. Okay, let's go. Burgle's waiting. We have the final super chip. And I have no idea what that means for the future. Hey, hey. I thought I saw movement for a second. Burgle, what's up, man? Always happy to see a repeat customer. How can I help you today? I found the last super chip. Eureka! The last one! 3,000. Alright, what are we doing? Time that we can complete the embiggening cocktail recipe. Hand over the super chip and we can get you home. No way, that's it. There's still so much yard to see. Of course. Toenails. The tiny impractical spatulas at the end of human digits. Well, have fun collecting those. And the final ingredient is... You're kidding me. You're not serious. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay. No, no, no. This cannot be correct. Chill, dude. Initiating refrigeration module. Perfect. Ah, that is much better. Please, allow me to explain the source of my very small planet. <laughs> okay. The first ingredient of the cocktail is marked as missing. Missing. I am not sure what to tell you. Dr. Wendell Tully purposefully wiped the last ingredient from my memory. Why would he do that? My programming prohibits me from remembering the secret ingredient. Wendell never wanted it to fall into the wrong hands. He did not even trust me with it. The entire recipe is <sighs> Wendell's noggin. And as I said, he has not been around for months. That's a typo right there, but that's alright. Sigh. Sigh. We gotta find Wendell? Processing. Processing. Chicken nuggets! Wendell's scabby! His scabby has tracking functionality built in. We should now be able to find out where he is with this information. We're actually gonna find him. The extra memory you provided with the super chips is helping my processing. Sorry, I did not think to track Dr. Tully earlier. Don't blame yourself, I guess. Allow me to connect to his scabby via my handy state-of-the-art radio modem to see what data I can pull from it. Where are we going, big guy? <laughs> Dial-up sounds. <laughs> I am connected to Dr. Tully's scabby. I will now start the download. Location, X5432, Y74356, Z19666. Okay. Scabby, prototype 0001A, power loss at circuit R23. Analyzing, error code 324, subminiature axial lead resistor, ominate model OC93412, failure. Call 555-0126 for technical assistance. Thank you. <laughs> Typical, does anything in this yard work? A minor setback, I know that location. <laughs> okay, what are we doing? Scabby is at Dr. Tully's favorite chair by the shed, of course. You should be able to find him there. Okay. The sh we're going to the shed. Take this replacement fuse to repair whatever problem he is having with his scabby. Okay. He should be able to help you out with the ambiguous cocktail and get you home in no time. That's the plan. Good luck. I believe in you. Thanks, Burgle. Thank you. Come again soon. 
Going to the shed, but we haven't done everything down here yet. I kind of don't want to go up there until we've done everything down down here. You know what I mean? Maybe we maybe we put off the uh, maybe we put off the quest for a little bit. Trowel Gulch, what? We have eleven thousand points. What? When? A uh, waft emitter. Piss off bugs with a variety of pungent bug part concoctions that waft throughout the yard. Different stenches bring different swarms. Bringing a swarm? No. No. I guess for like luring them, but no. Arrow designed to attract insects, lure trap. Lure insects with an enticing aroma. Quesa dill antlion. Chunks and bits of antlion folded and baked into an edible semicircle. What? Quesa dill antlion. Got it. Pebblet turret. Daydream, sign set, cookbook haze, I'm hungry or thirsty. Uh, spider sleeve, feather root, feather roofs. Could you imagine making a whole feather house? That would require so many feathers. Scabby scanner, upgrade for the scabby scanner module that allows it to detect other nearby scabbies that are not currently attached to a human host. Maybe. Sign set, no, we don't need sign sets. Pond, grass curve floor, buoyant. Uh, sign set crow, daredevil, another sign set, teen spirit, fortified bases, no, advanced smithing, glue masher, a building designed to smash bug pieces into glue to perfect, perf into glue, perfect for repairing more advanced equipment, okay, repair glue, oh, this stuff sticks to anything, can repair armor and weapons that have been upgraded past a certain point, spider chunks, bombardier parts, Mint chunks and something right there that I don't know what that is. Advanced smithing brittle upgrades. Brittle whetstone, brittle plate. We already have that. Advanced mighty glob. Mighty glob. A melted collection of sturdy whetstones shaped into a cubular glob. Perfect for imbuing equipment with special properties. Sturdy plating. Sturdy material used to upgrade armors even further. Sturdy whetstone, sturdy material used to upgrade weapons even further. Bye, 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 bye. Advanced production buildings. Oven. Bake various things into better things. Uh, maybe? Advanced smithing brittle upgrades, yeah. Brittle upgrades? I wonder what that means. But yes. Glue masher, sure. Everything smithing related is a yes. Advanced production buildings and oven, maybe. We could see that maybe that happening. Um, which means we're not gonna be able to afford this for a little bit more. What a shame. There's so many things to buy. This is crazy. Milk molars! We could get Hunger Thirst Strain down with one molar. I, I think maybe at this point it's worth one molar. One. One molar. And now it's even worse the second time. So yeah, we're just going to do the one point probably. Max consumable stack size, max resource stack size, max arrow stack size. Resource stack size could go up to 20. And consumable up to 20. Oh, that's tempting. Let's go resource 20. And then we'll do consumable stack size next time. We might start doing arrows eventually, but I doubt it. It's already a plenty of big stack. Black Ant Hill chip unlocks. You expanded the sign. Okay, so that was the Black Ant Hill science unlocks. If I ever have to start a brand new yard, I'm going to do the Black Ant Hill as soon as I realistically can so I can get that. That advanced smithing means we can advance smith. I just realized that. My brain finally clicked. That's immediately what we have to do next. There's no way we do anything else next. We need to get to smithing right away. And god dang, I need some water. And a new torch. Because it's dork. Ah. There we go. A lot of new stuff. Wolf spider somewhere heard me. Doesn't matter though, we're fine. Look at all those new ideas. Might have to drink out of the canteen here. Let's, we'll see. <laughs> Climbing a ladder is such like a, is such... It's such an effort, an endeavor. 
All right. We're back home. Let's go get some water. Should be some on the dew collector at this point. Uh, 20 minutes till that harvests. Maybe 20 hours is what it's saying. So another day till we can eat those mushrooms. Dew collector, there you are. And a hunger emergency. A couple emergencies. Okay, yeah, the bee is gone. <laughs> the bee's gone. Okay. So. Mushroom brick. A sturdy brick crafted from baking mushroom slurry. Well, that gives a whole new reason to have mushroom slurry now. And bacon and cocktail. A mystery ingredient. Five toenails. Wherever the hell we get that. Five gum nuggets. We already have the berry leather and the koi fish scale. Okay. Gum nuggets I know where to get. Once we get a level 2 shovel, which I think we did. Did we do that? Yeah, the black hand shovel, we have that. Yes, now we can get gum next time we see it. Sturdy whetstone, sturdy plating, brittle plating. Oh, you can just make it. What the hell? That's kind of crazy. Mighty glob. Two sturdy whetstones. I definitely have those. Sturdy marble shard. Sturdy plating. Oh, sturdy whetstone. Here we go. It takes two sturdy whetstones to make one mighty glob. Okay. And then sturdy plating. Sturdy plating drop. That's not good. Okay. Let's see upgrades. It's been so long since we've upgraded a weapon. Five Mighty Globs for Mighty. Oh, there's different versions. Have there always been different versions? Am I crazy? No, there wasn't. It was just this. Thank God. Okay. So, Mighty. 10% more damage and durability. Fresh. Mint Glob. I don't know what Fresh does. Salty. Okay, because, yeah. It, okay, so it has a typing. And certain enemies are weak to certain types. Um, if we go to data here. They're weak to spicy, salty, spicy, spicy, spicy. Looks like spiders are weak to spicy. Fresh is what bombardier beetles and infected things are weak to, and, and stink bugs. Salty gets the robots. Where's the wolf spider at? There it is. Spicy. Yeah, spicy is good against spiders. That makes me kind of want to do a spicy one, because to hell with spiders. Mmm. I don't know, though. Maybe. And larvae are weak to spicy. Bro, there's a lot that's weak to spicy. Mosquito are weak to fresh. Ants are weak to spicy. Like, actually, so much is weak to spicy. Fireflies are weak to spicy. Roly poly. Okay, yeah, we're gonna make a spicy one for now. Wait, does that require a different ingredient? Spicy glob. I don't know how to make a spicy glob. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on. I don't know how to do that. Sleek, increased healing, or 35 35. I think I'd just rather have more bulky or sleek. I think I go bulky, right? I think I go bulky here. Oh my god, I still never went to that underground area. That's right, because it was it would have been off camera and I didn't want y'all to miss it. That's right, that's right. Okay. Um Yeah, they stack now. To twenty. Oh my goodness. Clean up that inventory a little bit here. Now that we have 20 stacks. Look at that. Easy. Alright. Uh, back to this. Mm, okay. Over here. Condense those stacks. I'm just going to trash this one. This one. Alright. Good. 
Good cleanup here. This went well. Toenails. Where am I getting toenails from? I haven't even seen a toenail yet. Okay, there's the brat bursts, underwater stuff, arrows. We might need to get rid of five arrows. We'll see. I'll just leave five arrows here. Yeah, let's do that. That'll clear some inventory space. Flower petals we'll leave behind. Um, clover leaves and stuff we can leave behind. Sprigs. Bug rubber. I made bug rubber while I was trying to test out the trampoline stuff, like I said. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Got the slime lantern for underground, for underwater, underground, underwater as well. Okay. Okay. And eventually I'm going to replace this gas mask. No, I won't because it's already level five. So I won't be doing that. I'm just going to trash this. We're never going to use it. Can I repair it with the other one? Nat fuzz and a crude rope repair. Nah, so trash. Okay. Let's... Uh, we can make a mighty glob, but we don't know how to make a spicy glob. And it needs an oven to make anyway. Whoa. That's craziness. So upgrading weapons is actually a huge effort. Meanwhile, upgrading armor, a little easier. Increased healing or just better defense? I'm going to go with better defense. Locks this item into that type of rents. Any other upgrades from being chosen? Do you wish to upgrade? Oh my god, wait. It's like it's like really telling me to think about it. But I think so, yeah. I think I'm sticking with it. I want to max out this defense so I, we can take a hit. Like a real hit. Let's go bulky. We'll go level, level 7 bulky. Level 8 needs supreme plating anyway, so... 7's as far as it goes as is. Bulky? Yep. Yeah. Bang, and bulky. And now we have level 7 armor. Hell yeah. And if we can figure out how to make a spicy glob, we'll be good on that too. Because spicy is apparently very good against a lot of enemies that we will often fight slash deal with. Okay, and we have some extras here. We'll see how good the defense is now. Look at that defense. Oh, our block strength is so good and our defense is so good. We should be set for a lot of really good combat now. We have more acorn tops in the chest. I didn't even know. That might even be enough. Feeling That's different. crazy if so. That is crazy if so. We still need to make more torch pluses though. I need to make another torch plus though because I need stuff to be able to see. I hope this episode <laughs> finds you all well. Uh, I realize we're just we're setting up a bunch of stuff, and we're getting ourselves ready for future days here. Uh, I do think the next place I want to go is the rest of this like lower area. Um, maybe we go to the upper hedge areas over to this like Halloween mask. We'll see. I kind of want to leave this like upper area for last. It seems like right. There's his chair, obviously. I don't know. Is it going to be enough? Wait, we still need a bunch of weed stems. What? I thought we were good on the weed stems. No, we still need more acorn tops. Okay, it was just the one weed stem we were short on. Okay. So we need what? Three more acorn tops and we're done? Wow. We are right there. We're just not there. I do that sometimes. Three acorn tops. And we have what we are shooting for. Alright. And then we once we get that all the way around, we can start working on our zip lines finally. Because I feel like they'll finally be high enough that they'll be good to go. We need to go get some food. We need to eat. Need to eat something. Berry leather. 
Oh yeah, you can put berry um, chunks on this to make berry leather. I don't remember if that was on camera or not. That was bad. Where's my repair tool so I can repair some things? Sometimes I just hit the hit, hit the wrong button. There, now everything's healthy again. No problem. We're all good. Repair tool back in there. Okay. So. Things to do. Things to do. I think we can definitely head over to do that underground, that underwater area. That's, that'll probably be good for today. Because we're already, it's already, like, the day is already seven hours in. Maybe it's good we just go ahead and knock that out. Yeah, let's go do that. Let me get a torch. Torch plus. There you go. Craft. And now we have one again. Good. Alright, we have an inventory that should be set to go. We have all the underwater stuff we could need. An extra dandelion tuft. We're setting out. Maybe we drop the extra dandelion tuft. I'm not sure. Oh, I should have brought the grass pallet. That's right. Might as well. Ladybug over there. Uh, let me grab the grass pallet. We'll still make all. The, we'll still make this trip in time. I'm pretty sure. Everything will have respawned, obviously, because I've been in game for a few days. Sorry, but hopefully that won't be an issue. Insect axe needs some repairs soon. Larva spike and a bombardier part. We can do that later. We, I know we have the larva spikes. Uh, the bombardier parts are a, are a strong, probably. Acorn bit. Let me eat that. Gross, but needed. Needed. You don't have nearly enough food in your belly. Go ahead and put this on the pallet so when we come back we can go bring it up. I'm not going to bring it up right now, but I just figured it'd be good to have this ready. Okay. Some over here as well. Alright. Cut down a couple more grasses here so the pallet is set. And then we'll go on our little journey. Boom, bang. I don't know where all the grass went, but okay. That should be plenty. That should be plenty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. More than enough. Then we'll leave that right next to it, and then we'll carry that up next time and continue building around it. But for now, let's pop on the gas mask. Armoring up. Let's go. And definitely eat stuff on the way. Should be able to find plenty of mushrooms that I haven't touched in a long time. Like right here. And maybe a juice drop too. That was my discord. Ignore that. Juice drop. There you are. Got the thirst sorted and a little hunger, but the mushrooms will help with the hunger more than anything. Don't waste food. Don't waste food. Whoops. Alright, one more batch of mushrooms and we should be good on hunger. Here we go. With our level 7 armor. I love that. We should have made more healing materials. When we get near to the gas, I will trigger the fiber bandage. There's nothing to analyze. What's our brain power at, anyway? Oh, God! It's a single thing away! I didn't remember that! <laughs> We're that close to the next level of brain power. That's going to be sick when we get there. Okay, we're kind of on the right path. I'm going to go ahead and use the bandage now. 
It'll get me healing. Yep. Everything's back. Oh boy. I love it. Jesus. I jumped a little bit. It was nowhere near me. Alright, these larvae are going to be coming for us. We all know that's true. We know they're all around. Oh, that was a short trench. We got to get to that lab and make our move. Go, go, go. There it is. Leaking its stuff. No! I didn't jump! Holy shit. Why didn't you jump? Why didn't you jump? Why didn't you jump? Hoops. You're a basketball star. Why didn't you jump? We're still gonna make it just fine. We're gonna make it just fine. We're gonna make it just fine. It was a little uglier than I wanted, but we're gonna make it just fine. Man, I hope there's one more lab. I hope that wasn't the last lab, because I love these labs. They're so cool. Hello. How are you? Alright, let's get to the underwater part. Did these respawn too? No, they're still dead. Alright, here we go. Sneaking around here. Here we go. Now we're ready. How's our lantern doing? Better not give up on us. Is this a normal? Is that what the normal ones look like? Yeah, it's a diving bell spider. Man, this is, a, this is a trap right here. Come on. Let me swing around it. Thank you. Oh my god. If this goes out on us, we're going to be blind. The slime lantern better last. Okay. Come on, baby. Maybe this is where we get our key. For that one chest. Waterfully, no. God, there's two ways to go. Looks like there's air this way, so let's go this way. There's not. There is. Okay. There's a lot of water fleas. Where is this all leading? This goes outside, outside? Wow. Where is this? Yo, what? That's kind of crazy, right? Oh, hello. Oh, that's clay. Never mind. Huh. Anything behind this shovel? No? Okay. I felt like that would have been a good milk bowler spot, you know? Alright, interesting. This leads outside. Huh. Okay. Well, let's go this way again. Ow. Leave me alone. Just moving on our way here. Nope, nope. Don't mind us. Get some air. And then we're going to go the other way. Ah! Okay. Figured I should block that. Now, where does this go? Hello? I was gonna say, don't don't block me now. Not after we've come this far. More water fleas, goody. Okay, you know what? Here. We'll kill them. Just for their air. Just because I know when you kill things you get their air down here. Or whatever you want to call it. 
Am I not? That, that didn't look like I got air, so let's leave. It might have been a very tiny amount and I just didn't see it, but it didn't look like it. I know these spiders do, though. Yes, give me that air. Is that a mega milk molar? Worth it to come down here if it is. And some science, too. We like science. Yes, sir. And 500 raw science. Okay. And a scabby. Sewage. Okay. Pfft, true. Alright. We're out. We're out. Go ahead and fiber bandage away here. Alright, so we explored the area that we hadn't gotten to see before, and we got a Mega Milk Molar out of it. Beautiful. Now I think next time... Now I think next time I'm ready to go over to either the sandbox that was burning us before, or possibly the... what looked like a picnic table from afar. Probably a picnic table, just don't, you know... Don't, don't take it as like a promise that it's a picnic table. Alright. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get back home. Um, you're not going to miss anything else, so that's it. Uh, I will go ahead and start recording Grounded episodes once a day again. You know I love this game. And I'm playing this game until we either beat it, or until we lose all four teenagers. <laughs> and we still have three of them. So here's the hoping we can beat everything. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. If you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. Either way, thank you so much. For joining Hoops and I on this journey in Grounded. It's an absolute blast. And I will see all of you. There's granola bars here. How did we miss that? Next time.